It's the same old WR crew as it was two weeks ago in our Week 14 injury report, making it two or more straight missed games for these wide receivers. Unlike the past couple weeks, there's good news to report on Richard Matthews, Kelvin, Benjamin and Amari Cooper, but it's still mostly bleak outlooks for players like Robert Woods and Chris Hogan. Hopeful is the word that describes many of these players, and fantasy owners are equally as hopeful as they prepare their waiver wire pickups and starts at decisions ahead of the fantasy football playoffs. For updates on injured QBs, RBs, and TEs, like Aaron Rodgers, Joe Mixon, and Greg Olson, go here. For the latest fantasy news and updates, follow us on Twitter at SN underscore fantasy. Week 14 rankings quarterback running back wide receiver tight end DST kicker Chris Hogan injury update Hogan shoulder missed his fifth straight game in week 13. He HASNT practiced since week 8, and there has been no indication we'll see him on the practice field this week either. Per usual, the Patriots haven't released any new information regarding his status for week 14. Their HASNT been a single sign of encouragement that he could play this week, so fantasy owners should expect him to miss another week, giving a bump in value to Danny Amendola. Will Amari Cooper play in Week 14? Cooper concussion, ankle missed Week 13, but he is hopeful he can return this week. According to NFL Network's Ian Rapoport, Cooper's ankle is the main issue, not the concussion. It's an encouraging sign, but it's far from a sure thing that he'll play next week. He gets the Chiefs, who he torched for over 200 yards and two touchdowns earlier this year. Michael Crabtree will return from suspension, and he would get a huge boost in value if Cooper doesn't play. The combination of Johnny Holton and Gordair Al Patterson also would get slight boosts if Cooper is out since they play such a poor pass defense. When will Robert Woods return? Woods shoulder missed his second game in a row on Sunday, but head coach Sean McVay said he is shooting for a return this week, but Week 15 is a more realistic target. Sammy Watkins and Cooper Cup owners should feel safe this week against Philadelphia, but Week 14 will be interesting. Fantasy owners of all three players should keep up with his status throughout the week, just in case Woods plays. Week 14 DFS Yahoo GPP lineup Y Cash DFS lineup Builder Richard Matthews injury update The Titans still label Matthews hamstring as day-to-day, -day, but they are hopeful that he returns in Week 14. He's missed the past two games, but WR's Corey Davis and Eric Decker haven't been able to do much during his absence. Tight end Delaney Walker has received the most targets. If Matthews plays, he becomes a solid WR2 against the Cardinals. If not, Davis and Decker still have more value than usual, but they are no better than flex options. Kelvin, Benjamin injury news Despite a torn meniscus, the Bills expect Benjamin to resume practicing sometime this week, according to coach Sean McDermott. Asked if Benjamin could play, McDermott said practice leads to playing. On top of an iffy knee, Benjamin is also dealing with an iffy QB situation with Tyrod Taylor suffering a knee injury. That means Nathan Peterman would possibly start. Even with a strong matchup against the Colts, it'll be tough to expect too much out any Bills player not named LeSean McCoy.